this is a great place to grow oysters. Maine has um, a very good reputation for high quality seafood. People were eating oysters out of this river uh, several thousand years ago and there has been a renaissance in oyster production and most of the oysters that are harvested and sold now um, in the United States are farm raised. For Maine, the Damariscotta River is really the leader of it. The conditions are really good for growing oysters and it grows a world-class oyster. I feel really fortunate because pretty much every day I get up in the morning, I want to come to work. I look forward to coming to work. And I have been uh, somebody who needs to be near or on the water my entire life. Um, but probably the thing that I would not have anticipated when I got into the business that I find most satisfying is the fact that we've been able to hire a lot of young people who are educated and we're providing them with livelihoods, with benefits, and really contributing to the local economy. What I've learned to really love as I've um, advanced through my career is the intersection of business with science. We bring in a lot of different science disciplines into what we do here, and we will be trying to predict the kinds of um, changes that we're going to be facing uh, with, with climate change, with uh, increasing uh, acidity in the oceans. We are the canaries in the coal mine. We are, um, our livelihoods are to some extent, and we don't know the extent, threatened by a lot of different aspects of climate change. One of the things that um, has been very helpful working with the Gulf of Maine Research Institute is their, uh, their efforts um, around the issue of, of uh, analyzing the markets to kind of see what kind of strengths we have here in Maine and how we can access markets more broadly throughout the United States and perhaps um, internationally. And then also their efforts uh, towards creating an environment here in Maine where uh, aquaculture can become a major source of economic development along coastal Maine. I think that aquaculture will be playing an increasing role uh, in the working waterfront in the coast of, on the coast of Maine. Uh, it certainly won't replace the wild fisheries, but as wild fisheries um, change with climate change, uh, aquaculture does provide an alternative uh, to people whose background you know, has been on the water their whole lives and, and have those skills. What I really like about the Gulf of Maine is that it is um, incredibly beautiful. Um, it is geographically really complex and it really, because of the water quality and the high quality of the seafood that is produced from these waters, it is really the lifeblood of my business. Mm -hmm.